Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Planet Nomads. That's actually the third time I've recorded this episode. I've been having a number of rover troubles. I've lost three of them. The third one I actually had abandoned in the water there. But what I'm trying to do today is I want to first do a little bit of exploring uh, because I want to find some material. I want to find titanium, I want to find aluminum, I want to find gold, I want to find silver, and I want to find xanite. Uh, I was going to take the rovers with me, but the rovers are nothing but a pain in the ass. So, what we're going to do is we're going to head to uh, use our jetpack and try to cover some ground. I made a whole bunch of batteries too, and cleared up my inventory. Rovers are good, but yeah, it's... They, they are just... They need work. That's all I got to say. Now, I don't know how far I have to go. I basically have to be looking for like either open areas that you know what I'm looking for could could not spawn for a while. Maybe four or five hundred kilometers. Or it could even be like in this hole in the ground right here. Sorry to say what it's gonna spawn, that's just a pool of water. Those kind of things that are gobbling up rovers all the time, you don't see them. And then next you know, you get one wheel in, and, well, try to dig yourself out, but you only make things worse. I think I've been here already. I think I might have been here already. I was through this way. You might even see my old rover, I don't know. But, I go exploring. I have food and water, and Lots of battery. So I'm just gonna go and do a little explore. Whoa. Thank God for a jetpack. Woohoo. Oh, that scared me. I knew it was just gonna be water, if anything. You never know. But. Probably just gonna explore around a little bit. If I see anything interesting, I shall bring you back and. Show you what's up. Alright, well, apparently I have hit another biome, but four kilometers from home, I found gold and uranium. I think with the gold comes the silver, too. And this might actually be that xanite I for. Oh, yeah. Four kilometers, I almost died twice. And I'm not joking about that. And titanium, oh, sweet. Some do I have. Well, we're gonna get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. Rid of that. That's all common stuff like home. This is everything I'm looking for. You'll need aluminum and silver. Now, supposedly you can dig under the ground. I like these trees. These are awesome. Really nice. But no, I had a few run ins with a, a few characters. I was down. So like 37% health, I got attacked at night, I had to try to sleep, I couldn't sleep, I had to use two sleeping bags just to get enough energy to be able to do anything. Oh yeah, I flew into a tree too, that doesn't really help. Gold! Now, someone in the Steam discussions was mentioning that, uh, Apparently, if you just dig into the ground, you should be able to find it. Find the veins of it. I don't see anything, but I noticed the rock had changed. It was sort of like a gradual progression. Five kilometers from home. Yeah, uh, this is actually easier than trying to get that damn rover over here. What is that? Oh, that's a herb. Well, ooh, look at this. Oh, there's a cave. I believe that's a cave. It is. Yes, it is. Neat. Cool. Could be aluminum. Aluminum and cobalt. 
Oh, what a shame, what a shame, what a shame. It almost be worthwhile setting up a base close to here. Because we're right on the transition line. There's no reason why I just can't start building here. Right at the mouth of this massive cave. Do have beetles gonna watch out for. Wow. Go take a look at this. Holy Jesus, it's quite the cave. That vein. Oh, it's a plant. I thought that was a beetle. Good lord, this just goes on forever. Can't reach that. What is it? Uh, this is apparently nothing. I'm pretty sure this would be something right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think this might be a good idea. Because I'm right on the, the verge of the two biomes. I don't have to go very far. Maybe a couple hundred meters just to get back to the iron cobalt. Or the iron carbon. Silicone. And I think that's what I'm going to do. Oi. Up we go. Oh, jeez. Because, to be quite honest, traveling five kilometers to go from here to here whenever we need resource, resources is ridiculous. But yet, basically, we're right about there to be able to find iron and copper and silicone. This is everything I need right here. Oh, there we go. You can have our carbon and silicone right here. Oh, hello. These guys are annoying. Okay, what do you give me? Give me your loot. Come on, stop, damn you. Where'd you go? Even dead, it's hard to catch. Come on. There we go. Uh, just a little bit of meat and biomass. Well, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Is I think I'm going to set up here. Like I got everything I need. Oh, that was a close one. What do we have here? Telling me what I have. Not oh, more aluminum and cobalt. So yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do here. We're gonna set up our new base in our new home. Get all the resources we have to progress. The uh, take a little peek up the mountain. Ow, that hurt. Good to be here. Here we go. See. That's cool. This almost reminds me of an area north of where I live. You know, we got sort of the same sort of locale. But. Well, yeah, I think we're going to call the up, uh, make this our new base. And uh, also going to call the episode here. Anyways, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. It hasn't been exactly the greatest recording session for me, but finally found what I was looking for. It's not just this. I got the aluminum, the silver, aluminum, uranium, gold, xanite, titanium, silver, and aluminum. Okay, and the cobalt. Everything we did. But anyways, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a like, and I will see you in the next one. Later.